my name is Greg Bailey. Welcome to A Sculpture for a Small Planet. In this edition, we're gonna be talking about mosquitoes. I'm here in my backyard right now. It is uh, about six o'clock a.m. and uh, middle of June, and I have no mosquitoes, none. Hey, hon. Hey. So, uh, what's the worst thing about being outside? Mosquitoes. <laughs> so in this video, we're going to be talking about the relationship of mosquitoes to that of water. And mosquitoes need water in order for them to uh, procreate. So you got water, that equals mosquitoes. But in this video, we're going to talk about how you can take that water and flip it around on them. So water equals mosquito death. I got some prime mosquito traps, uh, rain water, and uh, you let them go for a little while, and you gotta check them all the time, make sure that uh, you don't let them go too long because you'll give yourself more mosquitoes instead of less. Mosquitoes have four different stages to their life. They start off as eggs laid on the water, and they're hatched into these little wiggling larvae that live underwater eating algae and other plants. Then they develop into the pupae, and the pupae then hatch into the flying, biting insects that we know as mosquitoes. So on the internet and other places, you'll find all kinds of ways of getting rid of mosquitoes in your yard with all kinds of chemicals, sprays, and so forth. But uh, we've actually come up with a very, very effective way of getting rid of mosquitoes without any chemicals and without buying anything. And you can use your old sculptures, pottery, or even an old bucket to do it. So we're gonna go through how we go over our mosquito patrol. And I've got my, my daughter here. And we've got some gear. We've got a net, a bug bottle with a magnifying glass, a water shooter sucker, and a white bucket. You ready? All right. We're going to go around and find water pools and then look for wigglies, which are the larvae of mosquitoes, and then dump out the things or suck them out to get rid of the water. Nice. All right. Any any water? Here's an old, here's an old sculpture, but it doesn't have any rainwater in it right now. There's only a little in here. Is there a little in there? Yeah. So. That's too fresh. That's from last night's rain, huh? Yeah. Is there any old? Make sure we don't get any more. We dump it out. Dump it out. So we got this water in here, which is just coming from our sump pump, um, which is really handy for watering. But every now and then, mosquitoes get in there, and um, then we have to drain it. Um, but I don't know if there's any in there. I don't think there is. Okay. Anything? No more. So, this tire, I'm pretty sure, had them in there, but it was so muddy, and I didn't have my my sucker with me and I noticed a few mosquitoes around and so I drilled holes in it and now there's nothing but dirt in it. Which is yeah old tires are terrible for collecting rainwaters and mosquitoes love them. I gotta fix this this tarp because this is not the best trap uh, because it's hard to check. Alright let me see. So, Did I forget my bucket? That's some dirty water. Yeah. Any wigglers? No. All right, I'm gonna check this one other puddle down here. Well, I got some junk in the end of our nozzle. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, you know, you clear that hat a little bit. <laughs> you lost wow. all your water. Yeah, there's more in there. All right, let me see. Some 
Oh. Wigglers? Yeah, it's filled with them. Filled with wigglers. Get them on video, so, okay. So, if you can see those wiggling things. Maybe maybe we've gotten a few hatchers out of there. So this is why we gotta do the mosquito patrol a little bit often. All right, so what I'm gonna do is dump this, <laughs> kill those guys. Now, I'm going to get all the water out of this tarp. All right, so now, is going to, we just killed about a thousand mosquitoes. You still got water over here. Except for one over there that I just dumped. All right, watch this. So all those specks are mosquitoes. So what we do is we dump it out. They're all dead. But people ask me, well, how do you know they just don't hatch after you dump them out? And the only thing that I have that says that they don't hatch when I dump them out is that we don't have any mosquitoes after. All right, you ready? Mm -hmm. All right, here it goes. It's gonna be a big one. Most mosquitoes don't travel more than 300 feet from where they come from. But if they are looking for water or they get blown by the wind, they will travel greater distances. Once they have blood to nourish them, their only goal is to find water to lay their eggs in. Once they get up in the trees, they search around, they'll find anything that they can lay their eggs in. They want enough water that it won't evaporate out on them. Sometimes they find it in house gutters, sometimes they find it in nooks and trees, old tarps. But you can set a trap and get them. You will not get it the day after. Hey, hon. The day after. Hey. How's the mosquitoes? There are no mosquitoes. <laughs> I could stay out here all day. <laughs> so you might live near a stream, a creek, or a pond. And uh, if they're moving fast, they won't breed mosquitoes. But if they've got some slow backwaters, and mosquitoes will actually breed right there. And your trapping method will work. The other thing is, is if your city sewers have a lot of water in them that doesn't drain down, breeding of, of mosquitoes in those those actual sewer drains. And you also need to work together with your neighbors. If there's any time that people need to start working together, it's now for all kinds of reasons, including mosquito uh, control. So make sure your, your neighbors don't have a bunch of standing water that they're not keeping track of or using as a trap. You see here this stream, a little backwater here. Let's see if we can't find some mosquitoes in here. There's a bunch of them right there. Mosquito larva. It's always nice to enjoy your backyard without bugs, especially mosquitoes. You know, there's all kinds of things that are out there. We got this one, and uh, either there's no mosquitoes, which I think is true, or let's go check that trap that we set the other day and see what we got. See him? Just can't forget that you gotta check them every every uh, five days or so. Right, Arnie? All right. Happy killing mosquitoes. So in conclusion, mosquito patrol is a very effective way of getting rid of your mosquitoes with no chemicals. They don't have to be manufactured, they don't need to be transported. Uh, you don't have any uh, specialized spray gear that might take all kinds of things to run and be stored and cleaned out. You also have no fossil fuels in this process. Nothing needs to be transported, manufactured, and uh, you also have no by kiln, which is really important for our pollinators and our honeybees and, and other important insects to our ecology. And then there is absolutely no greenhouse gas emissions with this process. Um, unless you've eaten some greenhouse gas intensive food for lunch, you are greenhouse gas neutral with this process.